In the mid-1700s, Laxey in the Isle of Man was a sleepy village. Then, in about 1790, lead ore was found, and a level mine tunnel was driven into the hillside. In subsequent years, further tunnels and shafts were dug, and lead, zinc, and some copper and silver was mined. As the miners followed veins deeper underground, water accumulated in the mine shafts and hampered work. Coal-driven steam pumps, as used elsewhere, would be an expensive option, as the Isle of Man had no coal. What it did have was a lot of water. In 1850, self-taught engineer Robert Casement was commissioned to design and build what became known as the Laxey Wheel, which utilises surface water power to pump out the water from the mine. The wheel was opened in September 1854 and christened Lady Isabella after the wife of the then Governor. Surface water is diverted from hillside streams to a cistern above the level of the top of the wheel from which a pipe carries the water down to the giant wheel. As water always finds its own level, the water rises up the tower next to the wheel and spills out into the buckets set into the rim of the wheel. Their weight pulls the wheel down and around, turning it at three revolutions a minute. The wheel transfers its power via a rocker arm at its centre to a crankshaft which drives a governor on one side and a horizontal power rod on the other. The power rod extends 600 feet back up the hillside to the main mine shaft. It is then attached to a large T-rocker which creates a vertical motion. This drives five plunger pumps at 300 foot intervals which lifts water 1,482 feet and discharges it into the Laxey River. Once built and in situ, apart from maintenance, this is a fantastic example of free energy from natural resources. However, effluent of lead and other toxic metals did pollute the Laxey River, so nothing is ever perfect. The Laxey wheel continued in use until the mine closed in 1929 and subsequently was preserved by local efforts until the Manx government bought it in 1965. It is now maintained by Manx Heritage. The rate of revolution has been reduced by running a thinner pipe from the cistern, thus reducing the flow of water, and as no pumps are now attached, the Laxey River has recovered from the pollution. At 72.5 feet in diameter and 6 feet wide, the Lady Isabella is the largest still functioning water wheel in the world and it is understandably now one of the Isle of Man's premier tourist attractions. And while the water flows, the Laxey wheel still goes and the Laxey river runs down to the sea.